Right, I've got to say something. Last night I went exploring and I went down to that point of interest and apparently I found the mother load of diamonds and this is how I managed to get this mount. And I was like, that sorted me out completely. I still get more from down there, but also I remembered where there was um, lithium because um, I managed to come across um, some lithium along the way uh, and I remembered where it was. It was in that... Um, purple area where you got those purple plume clouds and such and I was like that's where I got most of the lithium from so I'm gonna show you um, where to get that lithium I also showed you that point of interest as well um, I'll go for the lithium first then I'll get the um, food in it because something tells me I'm going to actually sorry I'll go for the food actually because that way I can actually keep myself topped up then I can it saves me going back and forth then I mean, all right, in this game, you're always going to go back and forward and such. But, yeah, you get what I mean. So I'll quickly make my way over here. Now, people say take a sea truck to the purple area with the purple gases in it. Um, you can take a sea truck if you wish to. But I personally just use a sea glider and I'll just glide myself around there. Although, word of warning, there are some dangerous creatures around there when you go hunting for lithium. And the place where you get the crystals is in the deep end. That's the biggest danger. And there are some grabby plants that like to grab you. And I do mean grab you. No, 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 why? I'm trying to explain something. Give, give it back my... F no, 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 no. Don't touch that. That's like my life support, you son of a bitch. See that cheeky monkey? I can't do anything without them stealing my shit. You know, that's not the first time you stole my shit. Now keep your hands off my sea glider. But yeah, now I've got my food and that. But as I was saying about, yeah, um, when you go down to the, um, when I go down to the point of interest, it's, um, the real big danger is mostly um, your oxygen and um, like lack of it, and the um, grabby plants that like to grab you. But, um, hold on. just fill myself up, top it up. There we go. Right. Um, but however, luckily down the um, point of interest is um, oxygen plants that can actually help you. So if you use them quite correctly and rightly, they should actually provide you oxygen to go down to 300 meters. Right, first and first, I'll go to the um, gas site so that you can actually uh, see where to get the lithium and such. And where I um, usually get it. Obviously, there's obviously easy solutions and this and that, but this one's one of the more easier. But I will warn you, there is a big danger of those things, but there's a bigger danger than it. Um, it's one of the Leviathans that's down here, and it's a big fucker. Not as big as the Reaper, but it's still um, pretty fast, and it's like it just doesn't leave you alone not uh, so much. However, you watch this thing be shy, and it's like, I'm not going to show myself because you've you got the camera on, and I'll be like, Bitch. Now you will hear it by when it makes us like a screech like sound giving it that kind of like it's not an ear piercing screech but it's like a creature screech. I don't know if that was it because I heard something. Now watch yourself around here. The volcano action around here is pretty high. I'm not sure if that was it. Oh yeah, watch out for those exploding fish. I think I just found my friend. It's right behind me, isn't it? Jesus Christ! It's more than behind me! And down here is where you can get some like parts, like your. Um, this is where you get your booster tank for your um, like your um, oxygen tank, because you can get a booster tank, but it does cost you your oxygen. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. You know, I rise myself up to the surface and hoping that this big biggity bitch leaves me alone. It's gonna catch me if I don't do something fast. Now you can fuck you! Oxygen. That really hurt. See that that thing doesn't just leave you doesn't leave you alone for one second. Well, sometimes it does. But yeah, there's me looking for my lithium, trying to show you lot where to get it to those you don't know and there's this guy just constantly hounding me he just doesn't want to leave me alone 
Yeah, go on, chop me down. Go on, I'll do you. Chop me down. M make me look like a silly, 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 silly. There, there you go. There's one lithium. Shit, I couldn't grab it because I was panicking from that thing. Oh, that's, that lithium's glitched. What a t long time to be glitched. That's two lithiums that was glitched. Yeah. This is why I say take a sea truck. I remember now. That thing is pretty fast as anything. Now, you don't want to be standing around too long here. Oh, where the hell is the lithium around here? But, yeah, you get the gist. It's somewhere around here and you can actually collect a load of them. And that's how I managed to collect a shitload of them. I will show you the um, other depths in it. Oh, I thought that was it. No, it's getting lucky, I thought. Ah, there we go. Hit some. One. Two. And you can also get more all down here. Also, it's got ugh, Port Central down here. Uh, but yeah, you just look around these purple light plume light areas, or volcanoes, or veins, call them what you will, and you're guaranteed to find some. Don't get me wrong, your sea truck is quite fast once you get the boost to, uh, into it, but if you're someone like me who hasn't got the boost, um, or hasn't got all the mods to it yet, and you need some lithium big time, then the sea glider will oh, 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 help you a lot. Just remember to zigzag a lot when you go against this, 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 this big, 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 big. It really, it really loves me. But yeah, you get the idea where lithium is, right? Anyway, I will show you the um, where I've got the diamonds and such. I'm just going to quickly nab some lithium here because I feel going empty-handed would be a waste. There's some lithium. There's uh, another one. That's right, you big, big bitch, come at me. You watch, she's gonna come at me and I'll be like trapped somewhere and I'll be like, shit. This thing doesn't want to leave me alone, it's got a lot like, hard on. Oh. Do you know what? I think that's a good sign for me to be burning. I was lucky to get away with just a chomp. But yeah, you get to just wait if you miss, right? <coughs> hey, I've got some more lithium. You better come out and pound me. Oh shit, probably took my advice too literally. Where's my point of interest? There it is. Well, I should be safe and away from that. Now. That is um, a Leviathan, to those of you who don't know what it is. Um, it's classed as a Leviathan as well. I wasn't too sure whether it was a Leviathan, but I had to do a little check on what it was. And yeah, it was definitely a Leviathan. One of the Leviathan species. Although they say it's the least dangerous of Leviathans. There it is. Now, obviously down here, if you haven't got all like the tech stuff like the sea truck or whatever you, um, make sure to have a sea glider for this one because you're going to need its speed to um, help you through this. And my suggestion is when you do go down to this point, don't stop um, rowing until you do, or moving until you do. Hold on, let me just pull myself up for some oxygen so I can actually make my oxygen last. But down here, it's about 300 meters deep usually. You can get some diamonds and gel sacks. And some other little bits. Just be aware of the squid sharks down here and the plants that like to pull you. Also watch out for these ones, but these are not so dangerous compared to your squid sharks down here. But when you go down here, you should come across an oxygen plant somewhere around here. Otherwise it's going to... Oh, there we are. There's one. Now, use these sparingly. I mean, this one's always good to use right now. There should be another one down here. Now, do you need to use this or not? It's down to you. Me? i say I've got plenty. But I will go down here. I should come across another oxygen plant. I'll grab this one to be safe and sorry. Again, it's best to be kept in yourself on the move. 
because you do get very dangerous predators down here and you should come across as you get deeper down here like diamonds and such make sure to have the um, the rebreather as well because that will help dramatically there's your first diamond watch out for that thing that will pull you as I said it will pull you don't worry you can get away this is why I suggest having a sea glider as well because here you can get all your truck parts as well but um, this is why I say have to see Grado as well because it does help out in the long run. But this um, helps get some of your truck parts if you ever want to get them on the early thing or, you know. Um, there's plenty of, um, of these oxygen plants but also use them sparingly because they're not going to be around forever. Obviously there's some other bits and bobs you can find down here. Um, what else is down here? Not sure. is that? that looks like something red but I don't know what it is. Might be just part of the environment. Uh, you've got more diamonds so this is where i found like the mother load of diamonds really so it's a lot more better than the other location that i actually found before which you will see in the other videos that i will post up in the future this one's just sunny for now now but yeah at least you know where to get them and that what I'll do i'll put this one together with my um lithium video oh i didn't realize there was some lithium down here so there is some down here as well so yeah you can get lucky to kill um, basically two birds with one stone but again watch your oxygen because you've got to make sure to keep that topped up and be very mindful that you may have to um, get on out of here but just remember everything wants to kill you in this game so be mindful of your surroundings and trust me that's happened too many times while making this video with me but welcome to my world. Not the, 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 this, this is my this is my point taken. Get off me! See what I mean? Everything wants to kill you. This is why it's best to keep on moving, never to you know stand still. I'm just glad I'm away from that big Leviathan thing because that actually really hurt. But anyway, um. But yeah, that's basically where you can get um, a chunk load of diamonds, gel sacks, and yeah, where you can actually also get um, things like um, lithium as well. I didn't realise that it was down there. But yeah, if you want to kill um, two birds with one stone down there, then you know that's your place. But be mindful, get your oxygen from those oxygen plants like I showed. You may have to slow the video down or pause the video a few times. You know. Do whatever you feel you can to catch up with it. But yeah, that's where I found the mother load of diamonds. Oh, I wouldn't call it the mother load, but it, it, you get a load of diamonds. You can grab a fistful of them and get a stock load. Um, it's the same goes with the lithium on the um, purple veins area. I said the purple vein area is more dangerous compared to the um, point of interest area. I'm not sure what to call that area, but yeah, because... I said the only danger is lack of oxygen, those plants, and the squid sharks, that's it. But compared to the um, purple veins area, I would definitely say that, is, that area is not as dangerous compared to the purple vein area. That, the purple vein area is much more dangerous than that. But anyway, I hope this little video helps out. Aboard, and if you need more um, information on stuff, like where to get certain bits and bobs, you just you know let me know in the comment chat and I'll see what I can do. Um, obviously I'm still new to the, the whole Subnautica Below Zero game so I'm just as I'm discovering it I'm actually putting it up as I discover it but anyway you all take it easy and peace out